Hi, Bean Beauty. So sorry this video was so long, but I want to leave an honest um, impression and review for y'all. And this bag really took the best out of me. All right. Thank you so much. Enjoy. Hi, Bean Beauties. Dee Dee Bean here. How are y'all doing? Thank you so much for joining me. Today is you know what day it's bag of the month day yes it is i did not get mine until late afternoon saturday and i still wasn't feeling good so today is sunday night um the sixth um so i didn't get it till the fifth um which is about normal when i get it uh, usually tara from tara's makeup and handbag she gets hers first and then I get mine um, like a day or two after after she does. Even though I um, even though I I um, place it at midnight, you know, stay up at till well, I stay up till two thirty in the morning. It because of the time zone difference, and um, so it's two thirty in the morning for me um, to do it. So I'm right there waiting, refreshing the page, refreshing the page until it until it turns. So. Um, but that's what's in this box. I just want to say thank you um, to everybody who, for those well wishes. Um, my, you know, my last video was I was letting y'all know I wasn't feeling very well, um, and I'm doing much better. I did have a couple of days. I um, got in our pool and was able to do some pool therapy, just try to get get um, some of the inflammation down. And so I'm feeling feeling well right now. So I thought I'd go ahead and. And film this I can get this out edited and get this out to y'all I'm hoping not to do too much um, have to do too much editing so that I can um, get this out to you quickly and hopefully by tomorrow morning if not tonight um, now I did not get the same color as Tara which still hasn't happened I'm wondering also too if I'm going to have you know what is sticker in here could i be so lucky twice in one month this is my first sticker in case y'all didn't see me get my first sticker and how excited i was y'all need to go check out last month's video the july unboxing video uh i kind of you know was a little bit excited but um oh okay are y'all ready i got the red one. Is she pretty? So if, if y'all have already seen um, Tara's video, um, it's a backpack. It's called the Pebble Green Medium Murphy Backpack. And um, that's what the bag of the month was this month. And let's check it out. Now, I did read on the Dooney website, they said, make sure you look under the, the tabs because I guess people have been complaining not getting stickers and nothing under the tabs. I'm like, nothing, nothing, nothing. Tara, nothing for me either today. But you know what, let's make sure they're not in the corners. Cause they said, please make sure. I made sure, Judy, nothing. Okay. Well, that's okay. But I'm like, stickers have to be like the least expensive thing that you could do and to promote your product and people get so excited about it and it as a thank you gift. But like I said, that was the first one, last one that I got. So, um, did I say, I think I did say the name, Pebble Green Medium Murphy Backpack. This one uh, was a little bit pricier than, than normal, but it is a backpack. It uh, was $139 even um, with the code August, because this is August. It looks like it's a numbered piece, but this one um, is 21 out of 75. But I do want to say that this time around when I was ordering it, even though I was right there and I knew right away what color I was going to get. Um, oh, okay. Uh, to check out, it did take me some time to check out because... Um, it kept saying, um, what did it say? It kept gave me, giving me a code of something like, something to say about uh, like congestion, something, it's, something's wrong on our part or something like that, please try again. 
So maybe there was just a lot of people trying to check um, check out this color and I wouldn't blame them. It's red. It, she's so pretty, isn't she? I had really, well, I got away from carrying, I don't wear the backpacks as a backpack. I usually just wear them as an, an over the shoulder um, or I hang them on, on my, um, on my scooter if we're traveling and usually it's just been has been the um the Vera Bradley ones because those are, are soft and they're light and you can put plenty of stuff in there and they're not way down let me go see if this one has um details for y'all there was some other colors um on there that I was interested in which was like the olive but they didn't have an image of the olive they had a bark, um, up the darker brown, I don't know. And they had a wine um, that they were, um, that I, I thought maybe I could be interested in, but it doesn't have a picture. And um, I'm like, ah, oh, I don't know if I want to chance it, you know, cause what if I don't like it? So I'm gonna go ahead and unpack, un take all the stuff off, okay. I don't know how we're supposed to take this off. I don't want to cut into it. Uh, let's see. Maybe if I look here, I don't want to cut into. I don't want to cut into the um, the leather. Whoa! I am back. Man, that was hard. It's definitely factory sealed. Everything came from, you know, the factory it hadn't been used, brand new or anything. But what they did was this strap, um, because they they put it on on the on the leather straps. I, I believe from watching some some videos that uh, how they make how to make handbag videos. I was kind of been into those, but they put them on here first, and then they feed them through there. Um, that's how you also have them on the handles and things that when the handles are not detachable, they put them on before they detach them. Uh, so it was like all the way through, which what was hard was trying to get them through the grommets because it has little grommets there. So it was pretty hard. So I paused the video for a while. I still, there was still some struggle um, that I'll be able to show y'all. But um, let me give you the, I think I took, yeah, I took, I think I took everything off. I went ahead and stuffed her a little bit and then we'll unstuff her um, so I can go ahead and show y'all. Uh, all right, her dimensions are height, 10 and a half inches. The length is nine inches. And then the width, the width of the bag is six and a half inches. And she's two pounds, three ounces. So she's actually pretty kind of heavy. And I was kind of looking at her around. I'm like, oh, I don't know. I don't know, don't know. So here's the front, here's the side, here's the back, and the straps come up here, here's the other side, here's the bottom, and here is the top view. Okay, what I do like, uh, I was trying to see if they showed it, and, and they did, is the contrast of this to this is a little stark for me so in person um so i'm not sure if i like that um the they are adjustable but they're not um detachable and oh i'm looking looks to see like there's I don't know if you can tell right there. It looks to see like there's an ink, an ink mark, a pen mark. There's some kind of mark right. Some kind of mark right there. It looks like a pen mark. That's kind of disappointing. That's never happened to me before. Um, let's, it's got a front zipper. Let's check the zipper out. Uh, it's got the red lining. So it's red on red like that. Um, the gold zipper, the zipper is very, um, very easy. And I like, easy to zip back and forth, I'm sorry. 
Um, I like the uh, I like the pocket. Um, it's got the is it like a white? My lighting my lighting in here is bad, but when y'all when we when I'm editing, the camera is is uh, picks up the detail very well. But it's just my eyes don't. Um, it has the the logo here and the, uh, of the the plate logo, the Dune and Deck plate logo, and then the stitching. It's either a pale yellow or a white. Um, I guess it could be an ivory. This, oh, oh yeah, that's right. It has pockets on the side, but let me see. Um, I usually have a little yeah, white, uh, small, let's see. Mm, not why I have her stuffed right now. Um, this doesn't fit in. I'll try again when I take it out, when I take the stuffing out. It has a magnetic closure, which I like that, but I like that, but um, honestly, it this is like too close. Okay, um, but this part should have been up here because this gets in the way. So unless this, unless the tassel is meant to be fed through here, let's see. No, I don't think it's thick enough. Well, I got one through, but that wouldn't... See, that's what they should have done, is got rid of this and just just fed the... You know, maybe, maybe I'll be cutting that off. I'll be putting... I'll be pulling a... a um, Jack's bag attack. Did you see? She bought a bag from Ed. A beautiful bag. I saw Ed's unboxing uh, of it when he got it. Um, or he was talking about it. And it was a coach bag, and it had these beautiful C's all over it. Um, and I just like how it embossed. But um, Jackie got it, and she did not. Um, it was not, the strap wasn't long enough, maybe, I think. So she took that sucker off. She's so brave. Her and Fisher Floyd, even from Fisher Floyd, are so brave. It's like, but, um, see, that would make better sense. And then you can close it like this. It would be easier to get to the, the snap closure like that. But let's see. Let me see how they show it. Uh, they don't really show it. Let's see. Yeah, they have it above it, which does not make sense. And I can't. I mean, see, things like that, I'm like, don't their um, testers, the reviewers, or whoever does it, don't they? get that and I mean that seems like an easy thing to do it's like either make this make this leather just a little bit longer uh, you know from here to here so that you could fit this in there and then you can you can do that and you don't need this so I don't know if that'll work um, but it being like this I, I right now I can't um, open and close it very easily so for purposes right now let me take these back out okay so there's back on the bottom i mean i guess if you had it all the way open then this would open enough and it would be easier but for me that's a poorly designed and that is like i don't know if that's something i don't know i'll have to think about that and see how i feel about that this way okay so here's the when you open it up, it's got the red um, material uh, lining, and let's see how wide I can get it. Uh, that spot is as wide as I can get. So, can y'all see the inside? See the inside. Um, it has the duty setup where you have the back zipper right here and in this back zipper I'm assuming yeah is the um, registration the registration card but I would just from feeling my hand the zipper it goes it goes to this part of my hand so so the pocket the zipper pocket goes from here to there so 
uh, let's do this water bottle since it's right here. So it goes about that much from there. So if I were to put the water bottle in, which would be my cell phone, let's see. In the zipper pocket, then you have that much of the the bottle. Do y'all see? Sticking, sticking out. And then we were also gonna see if the side pockets, nope, nope, water bottle doesn't fit there. Um, this also too, don't know, might be able to put some tissues in there. Um, that's kind of a waste of a pocket. I mean, if it's just for design, but it's for a pocket, uh, I would not be able to. Maybe if you have smaller hands, um, you can put your, Put something else in there maybe paperwork just real quick if you you know had some paperwork to put in um no bueno okay um so after the zipper the, zip, the zipper back up then there's a pocket in the in the zipper in front of the zipper it has a key fob and the key fob has just the regular leather um, um little the leather piece here um, and I usually like it when I mean not usually I love it when they when they match the this part of the leather um, um, key keeper uh, match it to the color of your bag I just think that that's just a on point um, classy thing to do <laughs> then on the front it has two pockets here on the front and they feel to be about the same um, so this one is much more roomy you could fit the water bottle in there and and that I sh so you could fit I could pro I could definitely fit my I iPhone 14 Pro Max is what I have so definitely would fit in that one the other one is a little one see and I think that too is a waste well I mean no I guess you could put other things in there sorry y'all I don't mean to be negative okay so here is the um the tag and it says that it is made in um in vietnam 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 um so here is the inside so it's a tight a tight fit on the inside i'm going to give you my honest opinion about this I actually was looking forward to it, to, to it, but um, I'm taking my, the things that I, I, um, I need for myself and, and, and things, this backpack is not going to work for me. I think it'll work. I, I need a more roomier backpack, uh, a bag, or, um, and I need more practicality in it. So these these pockets they're useless um, I can't put a water bottle in there it doesn't it doesn't fit it's not the diameter of that um, I don't know could I fit, put a cell phone in there I wish I could find my cell phone case um, I'll have to do that later is I'll have to take the cell phone case off of I'm, I'm recording on my cell phone um, right now so that's why I can't I can't show you that one, but I have the case that I always work with and I don't know what happened to it, but um, I'll use my cell phone and put it in there and then I'll, st I'll stick a picture in and see if it fits or not. I do have a, a, a large cell phone. It's the, the 14 Pro Max, so it's bigger. So if you have a smaller cell phone, you probably could. Uh, I need the outside pockets to to hold hold that. Um, this this zipper um, I don't mind. Um, you know you can def definitely I I would definitely could put my wallet in here like a small little wallet like if I were go to the doctor's office or go out to a baseball game or whatever that I do in my normal my normal days. Um, then I put that in there and you can take out the coin purse or take out your your medical cards or whatever um, easier than having to get in there so so that's nice I don't think it's long enough for cell phone but once again I'll try that for y'all 
this it is it, not work not work at all um yeah no nope um the inside of, of the bag um where is my bag let me see i'm still in, i'm still in my bar let me see my bag of the day Hold on. okay so i'm still in my um hydrangea bag and so this opens up a lot easier whereas here um it of course, this is, you know, bucket bag. This is a backpack, so I have to understand that. Um, let's see. The wallet. The wallet does fit in there. And we'll see. The wallet won't fit here, but what else do I have in here that is a size that y'all would know? There's this. So this is what I could put out there and that fits in there perfectly you know to, to do that um, so I don't normally do this but because this is for me is such a um, definitely I don't know and a big I don't know and I'd have to see so what I'm holding in here which I'm holding a little bit more than I normally do um, well it's 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 the change the change is just uh, makes it heavy. I have all the change. Um, have these. Oh, good. I have tissues. We can try that. And our bands to get into the game. Okay. So I also have to remember that this is. Um, canvas and that's leather so it makes a difference but the bottoms let's see. so yeah so this to compare these to the this bucket bag is bigger than the backpack um okay let's see what all fits in. what this is just the normal two pack uh, uh, Kleenex that you get, you know, like six of a pack or whatever. Um, so that would fit in there. So, okay. Um, it doesn't go all the way down. So it'll be sticking out. Don't know how you would like that. For me, that's what I would put in it. Let's see. But, um, yeah, well, let's go all the way down. I don't know. I mean, you can squish it down. I squished it down so you wouldn't see, and then you can still get it. These are just, these are tight for me because my hands are swollen, and I have bigger hands to start with, and right now they're, they're, um, they're swollen still. So that is hard for me to get it in and out. So if you are, you know, bigger frame person if you're you know if you have larger hands that would be hard you know, to get things in and out of um and like i said i i had i shoved this in there to go to go in there um these are the little toothpick thingies um i got them off of amazon these are actually really cool um you, you just pull them out they're in there and they're not like all over the place and there's um my husband does this. There's, oh, I don't want to do it. Um, you slide this out somehow. I don't know. This thing, the back comes off, and you, you can replace them in there, so you don't have to um, keep getting new ones. You just fill this up. Um, but that would fit in there. But once again, I mean, it definitely fits in there. But for me, having to get in, in and out, I would have trouble because, like, my fingers are getting stuck. See, they're getting stuck. Okay, so this is going to be a bag of the month slash review. So I'm, um, this right here, no, won't fit, won't fit. Okay, so really not much that I have that I would be useful 
my sunglasses, I don't have them. Sunglasses might fit in there. Um, I took them out when I swam today, so I'll be right back. Okay, so I normally keep my, my sunglasses in this little pouch. That would fit in there like that, and that probably would be easy to get in and out. If, um, if I didn't keep it in the pouch, it's got the cloth in there, it should be okay. It should be okay, I guess it wouldn't get scratched. You can put them in there like that. And now that, okay, so so that's a saver. Um, I could definitely keep my, my sunglasses in there and that would definitely work. So that's a big plus, I could handle that. We're going to keep, this is my little long shop um, um, coin purse. And I'll put that in here. I can put that in there. And let's see. Who's about to see? And I'll also put this in there. So that's what I would normally, um, if I was somewhere on the, on, you know, going to the doctor's office or to a baseball game, I would keep that there. Which, this one right here is like, um, I don't go anywhere without it. Um, it's got it's got pain meds in it and it's got extra um meds and um I've, pain meds ibuprofen that kind of stuff and it has a change purse and that fits well i probably could put something else small in there as well too maybe oh it's here this could go in there as well too right there so all that fits in there and there's probably still a little bit more room for something else so then thus i have i already have a wallet in here um, here, I've been using this all week. It's my emergency stuff. Here's that. There's this. This little clay has... I, ha I have all kinds of um, medical cards and stuff. Extra stuff for, for, for my medicines and stuff there. Tissues we're going to put over here on this side. Let's see how that goes. Okay, so I put the tissues over here. Um, I was having trouble because the wallet being in there gets in the way with the pockets, but there, you have to adjust it. This, okay, so that, <clears throat> the agenda, which I like that, fits in um, this pocket here. Fits in the pocket right there. And, okay. All right, so I'm feeling a little bit better about it. A lot, I'm feeling a lot better about it. So let's see if I can show you properly um, what it looks like in there. So that's what it looks like in there with everything. So everything that I had on the other one does fit in here. Um, of course, this is heavier than that. So I probably would want to downsize more, but all of that will fit. So we have that in there. Okay. Let's see. But sometimes things don't work as well when you don't have them packed with stuff. Okay. So that's a little bit better. Okay, so it what this does, when they put these pockets here, it gives it some kind of like a cinching, um, like a cinching, it gives it a cinching in of some kind, so where that it's not a huge backpack, it makes it smaller. Um, so it looks, it look, does look smaller. You can carry it with like top handle, which I do like that. Um, and here is the, um, and the strap so let's see I usually will hold it um, I'm five I'm five four and a half five five um, I would carry it like this um, either with one or two I would carry it like that okay I put it this probably can see it better I'm trying to find so so this is at, is at its shortest. So I'm trying to find kind of a happy medium. 
because the way that came, it was just a little bit too long and it slid off of my shoulder. Okay, so this would be how it is. I, okay. Oh. I wouldn't be able to carry this on the shoulder, I don't think, because it slides off. Um, at the shortest setting, it was too short. I put it out a little bit more, um, and it just kind of hangs too much because it's a he it's heavy bag. Um, now I didn't I don't mind it with um, once I put everything in, I thought okay it'll all fit. So um, if I were to keep this bag and use this bag, well, okay, who's kidding me? I'm not gonna turn, I'm not gonna, um, let's be seriously serious here. I am not gonna return it because it's just too much trouble for me to return. But we're also looking at the fact that when this, if this does um, go, goes off of ba uh, bag of the month, right now for bag of the month with the code of August is 139. So the set price that they have, of course, you know, the the price is three ninety eight, so it says starting in June of twenty twenty three, and it um, started off at three ninety eight, and then of course you know they put their mark down. So right now it's two sixty nine without, um, without the code August. So after August, then if they have any left or whatever they decide to do, since it's going back to school, it is two sixty nine. So if you're not a backpack person, like per se, that where you wear it as a backpack, or you, you know, that's how you would wear it, um, then, and you wanted to wear it as, you know, a shoulder bag or top handle, top, wearing it top handle like this, I'm, I'm definitely fine with it. I, I could do that. Um, it, of course, it'll fit on my wrist, but it won't go down any further on me. Um, so this it would have been nice if this was a little bit bigger uh so for me the, the straps are definitely a, a no-go no on that uh, i wasn't able to find an adjustment i i kind of paused the camera and um tried to um, find something but i just i just couldn't because of the angle because of the angle the way it is um it's not working you're not working for me and this is my opinions it's a beautiful bag beautiful beautiful bag the color is outstanding um but i just want y'all to go into it and make sure that you read the dimensions make sure you look at other reviews if, you, if there are any other any reviews to see because um for the bag of the month it is kind of pricey it's 139 for um for the bag of the month um, for august but it's also a backpack and it's per, you know substantial um and um so then it would be like 269. So if you were, if you were watching this later on, it's 269. Just make sure. Um, I, I have to think about whether or not I. I'm not sure. I might have to come back with y'all to, to y'all later and see um, what I decide. Because I'm already at 34, 34 minutes, and um, I'll, I'll be cutting some of it out. But um, it, this one perplexed me. Um, for bag of the month um, item. I'm sorry, I'm not 100% on. Last month was fabulous, and the month before that, I mean, they've all been really great that I, there was one month that I did not buy, um, and it was before I actually started doing the videos, I think, of, of video of the month. Um, so there was one bag that I didn't purchase, um, but so, uh, I don't know what I recommend this bottom line. I don't know. I don't know. It has to be what you are comfortable with. So I gave you my, my, my cons, the pros and cons. Um, pros is beautiful, gorgeous the colors, gorgeous. And, and I do like the design of the bag. I mean, especially now that I have it fixed, you know, um, actually have my products in it, my, have my accessories in it. I like how it looks. For me, it's heavy to begin with. It's two pounds, three ounces. So 
So if you're consider, if you're, I have had some, some of my um, viewers or some people who, you know, some of the viewers have commented that they um, try to keep light as well too. So that's why when they do have the pounds on there, I try to lay on no. So this is definitely a heavier bag, which I think my red satchel bag, I wonder if this is more than that one. All right, so for those for those of you who keep the um, weight of a bag prior to all the accessories in mind before purchasing, this bag is um, two pounds, three ounces before you put anything in, purchase, you know, empty. The, my, my red satchel, dome satchel, I'm sure y'all seen it if y'all, if y'all watched any of my videos. Um, it's the large, I have the pebble grain large dome satchel and that one to me, you know, is, is heavy, starts off heavy for me. That one's one pound, 15 ounces. So this is double, double that. Um, on the weight before. So keep that in mind for those of you who, who need a lighter product. Um, so definitely if I were to use this in, 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 um, for my lifestyle, it definitely would be a car bag. And what I call a car bag for me, what I use, what, when I refer to a car bag is it's a bag that I just use in the car. It's from the house to the car, go either sit to pick up the grandkids or sit at, you know, we're running an errand that, you know, it, you just run an errand real quick and you're not really getting off the car or if you go on a you go on a on a trip and um a day trip or something that um you'll be most of the time will be in the car and you just need your essentials it would be perfect for that because it's smaller like it's compacted um so it's like smaller than the dome drawstring bag so this the size of that would be great but it's not something that i would take off into um the, to the store so so say if we were on a day trip though and then if we were going to stop by bucky's to go in and take a get a snack at bucky's um then i would just grab in here and i would take out um my little this little thing that had my little wallet in there um, had some money in there or what have you and that's all i would take and i would leave the rest of the bag in the car so it would work great for okay. that. So I guess the final thoughts, my final re review for now on my on my first first um, looks, first impressions. My final thoughts is that you need to be really thoughtful if you're going to purchase this uh, backpack. Um, if you're not a backpack person, this is not a backpack to start off with. Flat, flat is out. I definitely would say no. Don't don't start off with this backpack if you're not a backpack person. Don't do it. Um, if you are a backpack person and um, weight doesn't matter, um, then um, this would be it, it would be good. But know that you're limited of what you can put on the sides. But like I said, it's perfect for the shades, and um, that would be great. You know, great for me. Uh, so just one it gets a little stuck because of things on the inside get in the way of when you're trying to put that in and out um, it's heavy puppy it's two pounds three ounces it's heavy um, I don't like this it's too inconvenient for me it's it's to me it's it's difficult it's poorly designed. That is a poorly designed feature for me. Um, so I think regardless of whether or not you have trouble with your hands or if you have um, anything like that, you need to really uh, take into consideration whether or not that's going to bother you or not. Because see here, I'm trying to close it and it and it and it's like it's catching Okay, there, yeah, on there. Um, but, there we go. But see, it wasn't closed all the way because this little part, the little slow leather part up on the top, got in the way. So if that matters to you, if you're a person that likes, you know, more security, 
you need to think about that and it's you know not easy these that the two mechanisms together does not work so you need to have, keep that in mind the inside and everything is okay um but like i think what i would do is even though the wallet fits in there the full-size continental wallet fits in there i probably will switch to a smaller wallet to to go in there the, the half wallets because it fits the full length of it but then it gets in the way of me trying see now i can put the glasses slide them in and out easy without any problem with this it fits but then the glasses are hitting right here on the edge because this is goes from edge to edge of the inside of the bag um the rest of the stuff in there is not not a problem the pockets like i said i the my agenda um um fit in the front um big pocket i don't have anything that really would fit so i definitely i was going to put this on it that my little dooney uh dooney duck keychain i thought that would be great on the backpack but no N yeah no way because this is pretty heavy on its own i took it off of the um, drawstring bag because it made the drawstring bag because i was carrying so much in it I, no way to put it on here anyway because um it's too it's too heavy already. put it on there i just i just shortened the the link of the of the chain and so it would go on there so okay let's see that's a little bit easier i turned the i turned the wallet long ways up up and down because uh, there's definitely plenty of room so that would be another option as well too if you wanted to keep the longer um uh, the large size wallet for me um, if this is an item uh, 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 that i would be able to use um it the jury is still out um it right now has a lot of a lot of cons which I'm really disappointed about because it's a beautiful bag. Um, it's a pricey bag. <laughs> um, it's a pricey bag in general. It's a pricey bag um, for uh, the bag of the month. Um, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry I'm all over the place <laughs> with this one. I thought this was going to be a quick um, video that I did not have to <laughs> edit. Um, but, um, yeah, kind of disappointing for me on this one, on the backpack. Go over though and watch Tara, um, from makeup and handbags. And she did the, the duty of the month as well. She chose a different color. So then you could see a different color, um, that she chose. Um, and she chose one of the colors. She, she was, she's a gambler. She chose a color that was not, um, they didn't have a picture shown um, offhand right now. I don't remember what color it was. Um, no, I actually really, really don't remember what color, what color, what color she, she chose. Um, but go over there and see what she says about it on her, her first impressions are opening up. Um, she's actually had decided, she's not a backpack person, but she had decided she's keeping the backpack for herself. She normally, when there's backpacks, she normally gives them away. But this one, she decided to keep. We'll go herself. see what she says and see what she likes as well too, and and um, and do what I'm here, and then just making it. You know, that's the best informed decision you can make. I guess it's just kind of going and looking. I don't know. Like I said, the, the jury's still out um, where I am concerned, and um, and I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Couldn't be a hundred percent on board with this, but um, I definitely want to be honest about things. Um, it's beautiful coming out of the box, beautiful, um, you know, just beautiful looking at it. But um, this bag right away, because there's, there's several bags that you don't know until you know. You don't know until you use it, if it's a style that you really like, if it's gonna, you know, what you're gonna like or what's gonna, you know. And I, ha I personally have so many things that I have to think about, you know, I'm sure a lot of you don't have to, but, um, but this is the first, um, the first one that right off the bat that I'm going, oh, I don't know, I don't know, um, as far as the bag of the month. Um, so, yeah. Whew.
meh. Thank you very much for joining me. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Um, but um, she's beautiful. Um, once again, thank you for joining me. Thank you so much for for um, coming to watch my channel. And thank you so much for those of you who um, have stayed to the end. And, and thank you that um, that for all of oh, y'all who... who stay to the end um to watch my videos i greatly appreciate it i greatly appreciate it if you just come in and, and when you just look in you know looking for a little while i appreciate any any kind of uh, support that you give to the channel um by watching by commenting by liking by subscribing all of that helps to grow my channel um and um i greatly appreciate it and all your love and support while um i'm kind of not feeling well and going through my flare-up so thank you very much for all the the positive wishes that y'all gave me um for my video that aired on on sunday um so thank you very much and um good luck if you're trying to decide whether or not to purchase this or not let me know let me your, know your thoughts your feelings and um uh, let me know what you what you decided Alrighty, thank you very much. Love y'all. Bye-bye.